Hi, I'm Ashley with The Lore, and we're at Winter Nam 2014. I'm here with Travis Atz, our Director of Product Development. He's going to show you a little bit about what we have in, in the works for 2014. What do you have, Trav? The, well, what we're really excited about is the first Delore U.S. Custom Shop piece, the Model 33. Can you tell me a little bit about it? What makes it unique? Yeah, absolutely. It's a fully hand-carved instrument. It's assembled and finished here in the USA. It's got a Seymour Duncan Charlie Christian pickup with the original mounting hardware. It's got a custom-made pick guard that we made in-house. Uh, the quality of the wood and the finish, as you can tell, is totally unbelievable. Uh, it sounds really great and really authentic for the style you come to expect if you see this instrument. Everything's done here, all of the finishing, all of the wiring. Any other components about this that we should be aware of in checking it out? The, well, the, it's some of our other equivalent things that we have in the line of 24 and 3 quarter scale, carved and graduated by our guys, um, Ebony Fretboard, Ebony Bridge, and it's just a great sounding instrument we're really excited about. When people see this, they'll know instantaneously what, what the builders were going for when they were making this happen, right? The, I, I would like to imagine, for sure. That's great. Let's see what else is there. The, we also just completed the LH301T, which is a fully hollow thin body, so laminate maple top and back. Uh, it's definitely intended to be an electric instrument. It's got the lower P90, and with that fully hollow nature, it just has some unbelievable overtones. Since it's thin, it's really comfortable, really easy to play. Uh, it doesn't get too outrageous as far as feedback goes or anything, but you can control those overtones in a really cool way. Very cool. What else do we have? Uh, we've also got the LH280, both in black and sunburst. And this, as you can tell, is a cutaway guitar. It's maple top and back as well. And the two humbuckers, as well as four volume controls, three-way switch, really give you a wide, wide sonic palette you can work with. Nice, nice. That one next to the, those is pretty interesting looking as well. Can you tell me about it? Uh, yeah, this is a limited run finish that we're doing in our LH309. So this is a hand-carved top. Um, the lower P90 once again, and we're doing this black matte finish only in a few hundred pieces, and we're really excited to kind of get in into some other markets. People have been asking for a few different looking things. Same specs as the 309. Same just specs as our LH309, but new finish. Seems like we're doing a lot more electric guitars than uh, ever before. Can you say a little bit more about that? The, well, I would say that's definitely true. We really have been hearing from players that the hand-carved stuff is right up people's alley. We're really excited and happy for that, but at the same time, uh, we want to give players of all different styles a few more options, and especially the combination of the hollow body and the amplified uh, ability has really been something people are asking for, and we're trying to do it. Awesome. Another area where we've been having a lot of fun is with our mandolins as well. I know we got a couple new series to check out, so let's do it. The, this is our new grassroots series. This is a hand-carved solid top instrument. Uh, it has a satin sunburst finish, and we've cut off the end of the fretboard as we have on a few of our other models so that the fretboard extension doesn't get in the way. Beautiful sounding instruments, and only $299 for the A model and $399 for the F model. That's awesome, that's awesome. Uh, any other uh, carved instruments coming up? Uh, yeah, I'd love to show you the LM290 and LM590, and this is a new series that's all solid, hand carved, but a few contemporary touches. No binding on the back, so it's a little bit stripped down. Uh, also, again, no fretboard inlay, or no fretboard extension, I should say. And the finish is a slightly different color palette, so we're really trying to give people what they're requesting on colors as well. That's great. So there you have it, just a taste of everything we're going to be showing you throughout 2014. If you want to learn more about these or any of our other great instruments, you can check out www.thelore.com. Thanks so much for checking out the video. Enjoy the rest of the show.